Okay, let's get right to it here, and welcome back, Mr. Jim Mars. Another thing that struck wow. me is something totally different from what we've been told occurred at the Pentagon. And, of course, yeah, we're told that Honey Hanjor uh, took the controls and did this incredible 180 spiraling diving c- curve right. leveled out at, at just ground level yep. and then smacked into the Pentagon. Well, number one, this is the same Honey Hanjor who just a month or two before had been turned down from flying a Cessna. He couldn't demonstrate that he knew how to fly that little private plane. Right. So, you know, it's just it's just ludicrous. You're saying this uh, alleged hijacker, Honey Anjur, could not solo a 150? He could not solo. In fact, one of his flight instructors, and I quote him, he said, the man could not fly at all. But here, and now here's the clincher. According to pilots for 9-11 Truth, they finally got the black box data uh, recording material from Flight 77. And one of the parameters in there showed that the door to the flight deck, the door to the cockpit, was never opened during oh, flight. Really? How easily billions of people can be led. And let's just overlay that simple technique of lying with really shrewd pre-planning and take it back to the Korean War, World War II, any other major event of the last century you want, which deals in control ultimately. The lies of history, I think, far surpass the truths of history, at least the corrupted parts of it. It's scary stuff. Well, and it's nothing new. You know, uh, Adolf Hitler wrote in Mein Kampf, and he wrote that back in the early 1920s. And I'm paraphrasing here, but essentially he said that people will fall victim to a big lie rather than a little lie. And when you have a big, top-heavy bureaucracy, it is really easy to keep the left hand from knowing what the right hand is doing. And all you got to do is just issue a few orders at just a few strategic places. Things happen, and even the people down under who are carrying out these orders have no clue as to what the ultimate agenda 